will have a set piece. But all eyes on Lionel Messi. Sergio Busquets into Messi. Flag Hello, dear friend. I am Freeman. Welcome to Football Gang. of dollars just to watch that man, Lionel Messi, a reigning World Cup winner, a seven-time bowl. There is the Inter-Miami starting 11, similar to zero in Liga MX. He's one of the big four Mexican in the Lionel Messi era. While playing the game. Bruce Azul trying to do that to Inter-Miami, coming forward, first minute hole off Kamal Miller on Cruz Azul. Overlapping run here from Rotundi, but he was in an offside position. It felt like it was close. So where he's going to go. Here comes Miami. Robert Taylor. Leo Campana out. Finland will serve for Inter Miami. That will get a second chance. Ground cleared by Cruz Azul. They might be able to break out. Lovely turn from Moises. Here comes Cruz Azul. DeAndre Yedlin defending. Cambindo coming forward. Rivero is saved by Drake Callender. Dixon Arroyo's got to be extremely careful. You cannot get turned that easily there, especially when you know Yedlin's 1v1 on the backside. Good recovery here from Inter Miami. But that ex again. Here we go for Cruz Azul. Can they take advantage? In Inter City, and he scored six goals, but he was unrefined. And Tuna was in major better at being efficient in the final third. They're Messi and Miami. But he's also motivated. It didn't go. go. And also the time. Bit. Campana coming through. Campana pulls the center back in a bad position. A difficult. This is just fantastic work from Robert Taylor to come. Allows Campana in behind. And to get behind Frey. Carlos Rotundi cutting it back. Rotundi curling it off the post. And the Rio. Oh, Carlos Rotari is get in behind Ian Frey. I love the cuts, but then the finish off the back post. Cambindo needs to be a little bit more composed because the goal was open. But how about that attacking play from Lynn? Kramaski back to Yedlin, pops it in. David Ruiz goes down. Robinson back hill. Movement mate on the field, but he's talking, often leaning over to Joseph Martinez, speaking about the game, pointing out different. Uh oh, for Miami, Cambindo wide again. What? It's four or five touches, and Cruz, Cruz Azul is in behind. Still Moises, and back towards Moises. Charlie Rodriguez. Ignacio Rivero. Rivero. Rotundi whipped across calendar. Unable to hold. Thinking about it. Sliding it to Antuna. Antuna cutting it back. And then again. And then in. Antuna towards Rivero. Frey sends it away. Frey tore his ACL two straight years in training in the preseason. Missed two and a half years. He comes back and back to Rodriguez. Cutting inside. Still Rodriguez. Cambindo trying to turn. Kramaski at the line. 20 minutes tonight. Robbie Robinson. Step over. Robinson to the byline. Knocked away. DeAndre Yedlin. He's looking for Campana. Oh, was there before today. David Ruiz looking for Robert Taylor. DeAndre Yellen. How about that for a ball? Yeah, big switch over to Robert Taylor. Taylor. Taylor! Again! Robert Taylor, what a goal! Inter Miami lead 1 0. As we get closer uh, to the moment, right? Which we think. Expected 60 minutes. And then you will start to see the chips fall where they may into the situation. Be interesting to see. I'm still with the mindset 20 minutes or less. A second half underway in the League's Cup. There's been so much anticipation really for a month. In a 60 yeah. minutes. Just gonna motivate me to score goals even more. I'm not concerned. Miami. 
Keeps possession. Allen sends it across. It took a deflection. Getting warm already. Maybe an indicator. Lionel Messi stated his intention to come play for Inter Miami. Stretches that one of your teammates is doing in a corner. Yeah. We thought maybe 15. It looks like it's going to be more. We'll have a set piece. But all eyes on Lionel Messi. From calendar, that ball was dipping and moving away from the goalkeeper to that back post. And here he is, his first time on the ball. First touches for Miami. Into Robert Taylor, he gets it back. Soccer in North America. On the pitch for the first time in an Inter Miami shirt. He'll get at least 35 minutes. And he immediately puts on the armband. Oh, he had been leaving for Messi and the Taylor. This is so good for Miami. Messi. Rivero does well to take it off of Messi and throw a foul. So much for one to grow into the game, huh? In behind. Messi's just going to operate in that space that's going to ask a ton of questions of the back line of Cruz Azul. He's going to attract. Messi. Into Martinez. Back to Messi. Chase down. And taking the back line of Miami. Busquets forward to Messi. Yeah, but people forget David Beckham made that debut on one leg. Yep. He did anything and everything he could to show his face, get on the field, had an awful ink. Quickly into Martinez. Joseph turning. Immediately a quick one where Joseph Martinez is coming out of in. Calendar couldn't get to it. And Tuna to scores. Oriol and Tuna levels the match for Cruz Azul. <laughs> Was Direct player Tato Martino likes him in wide areas. He starts pacey, wide player. Nifty touch from Yedlin. Oh, Messi spinning away. Back to Yedlin. Yedlin! It was blocked. Guerrero the tackle for Cruz Azul. Great tackle from Guerrero. But it, it's exactly the pattern of play that I'm telling you about. Because if Messi gets into this hole, DeAndre Yedlin has a ton of freedom to get. Messi will serve. Is he going for it? <laughs> I think he was. Consistently turning you inside and out between the ears and on the field. There he is again. Does he have the legs in a league like this that's physical, but between the ears, he's four or five steps ahead of everyone else. He leaves it for Messi. A little water bug. His nickname is The Flea. Professional, their senior career. And a lot. Wisconsin into Messi. Messi! It was blocked. Messi. Yedlin. The conversation is when that ball's played in, see DeAndre Yedlin saw Joseph Martinez, but what Lionel Messi's telling him, it's often the next layer, the second or the third runner coming in behind. A little bit sooner to the near post, that second ball into Messi coming in. Messi. Oh, what a ball. Martinez, continue up his line. Martinez is around. A great amount of space, but time, no pressure on that. Textbook run from Joseph Martinez. But other than that, Callender's come up with two or three big saves to give Miami a chance. Messi in the midfield. Over, back to Messi. 
Immediately closed down, still on it. Busquets clips it back in towards Messi. Messi goes down. Like a, a deep line position. Escobar leaving his run, leaving Robbie Robinson. Is it clear and obvious for me? You. Messi in the midfield with a ball. Sergio Busquets into Messi. Flag is down and it's blocked. He down and is a corner. How about that ball from Busquets? Eyes on the back of his head. Whether Messi's on the field or not, he's going to do the exact same thing. I have zero problem with that. But that ball from Busquets was ridiculous. Messi to have the half a turn. I Messi is in. The flag is down. Messi. Oh, cutting it back to Joseph, who taps it in. Face where neither the center back or the fullback on that. Messi around one and another. Toying with Cruz Azul wide to Lionel Messi. Finds Messi. Messi slides it to Martinez. Back to Messi. Oh! Martinez is picked up. How to play off of Messi. And I'm not. And a little alarming from a Cruz Azul perspective. He may be playing himself into fitness, but he hasn't lost that first touch, and he hasn't lost the competitive streak. Catinho wouldn't have known. Go to penalties if it's still 1 1. A reminder there are no draws in Leeds Cup. Level after 90, each team's into Messi. Immediately closed down. Free kick given. His lip. But he ran into it. Here it is. Messi! Could it have been any other way? Magnificent! set piece but all eyes on Lionel Messi from calendar that ball was dipping and moving away from the goalkeeper to that back post